Food Adventurers, guess what? Guess what I did today? This here is definitely special. It's only special because it's like a, a versus thing that I'm gonna do today, all right? Now, number one, you have a lot of people who don't eat beef, okay? You got the chicken and fish people, all right? And the chicken and fish people, normally, they like to hit up those good chicken and fish spots. I mean, not for nothing. If I'm gonna eat some fish, I'm gonna go somewhere where I could be like, yeah, I had me some fish. But then again, when I'm on lunch, and I just wanna grab something simple, I go to places that I really shouldn't even be advertising. But I went to Popeye's. And guess what I did? I'm gonna show you. Hang tight. Now, RMD Food Adventures, what I need you to do right now is pay attention because this is going to be great. A great comparison. I'm sitting here in the BM. Yeah, of course. Doing my thing. That's all I ride. You know, BM. I'm not trying to show off, but I just worked my way up to that point where I can have cars like this. You know, but anyway, it's not about the car. It's about the Popeye's new fish sandwich. Yes, the fish. Yeah, fishy, fishy, fishy. But anyway, I'm a stickler for fish. All right, let's not get it twisted. I love some fish. And then at the same time, I love me some chicken. So guess what I did? Guess what I did today? I went and got a chicken and a fish sandwich. And what I'm going to do is that I'm going to compare it for you. Okay? I'm going to let you know how it is tasting. Everybody's already familiar with the Popeye's chicken sandwich. I mean, people were getting killed for it. Losing their jobs. Not voting. My people, stand up, be right. You know, cut it out, cut it out. It wasn't that serious. But anyway, this is a serious comparison I'm about to make. I'm going to let you know between the chicken and the fish, which one is the better one. Or maybe they might break even because remember, fish has a different taste than a chicken. And so I'm going to open this up one by one. I'll probably start with the uh, chicken first and then I'm going to get to the fish. All right. And mine, I like it with extra tartar sauce. And so give me a second. Let's get to cracking to see what's really good in these bags. Be right back with you. Now, as you can see. I'm digging in the uh, chicken first. You know something? Popeyes did not fall off. You know like how some restaurants you go to, not restaurants, but fast food joints you go to, you know, once they gain the popularity or the notoriety on one of their products, they fall off all of a sudden. The macaroni soggy, the peas all mush, and the chicken tastes like what? For you young people out there, that's Sugar Hill, all right? Sugar Hill game, you know. But anyway, we're not talking about them. We're talking about this chicken sandwich. Now, let's begin. Ooh, I hate when I start messing up my BM. Let's start by cracking it open. Damn. And looking at the inside. You see that? Okay, they got a little bit of sauce there. And normally, you're supposed to get three pickles but I only got two. So Popeyes, don't start pickle by pickle punking us people, okay? Three pickles is three pickles. Okay, now, let's go in. Never fail. I don't get these often. But whenever I do, I remember. These chicken sandwiches have been around since the death of somebody's uncle that was online fighting over one of these things. But that great taste. And this is the mild one. It's still in place. Calling my fish lovers. 
Polar SpongeBob and Squidward. And Mr. Crab. Now. Come out like this. All right, now. Here we go with the fish. You can see. It kind of looks the way it does on the commercial. That's one thing I could say honestly about Popeyes. Like the way it looks on the commercial is usually the way it looks when you get it. You know, I hate going into a burger joint, something like that, after seeing an advertisement. And everybody out there knows what I'm talking about. When you have the big burger and you see the uh, tomato perfectly put into place between the buns. You see uh, um, the lettuce hanging out just perfectly, the onions. And then when you go there, it looks like a hockey puck. Okay, now, let's remove this from the sleeve that it's in. Delicately. I don't want it. Oh, oh shoot. Look, there's room for play. What? 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 Whoa. Look at this. Look at that. Hanging out of the business. I mean, like, not for nothing. Let me let me go around for you in the circle. Okay, now we got the tartar sauce, both ends of the bun. Oh, and check the bun. Oh, 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 oh. Oh, soft, 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 sucking breast. Anyway, I'm not that singer dude, okay? Now, let's go to the bottom part and see what's good with it. Okay, I see they have pickle. Now, a lot of people would say, you know, why would they put pickles on fish? Simply because tartar sauce has like a vinegar type of taste. You know, I mean, in fact, the same things, the same ingredients, rather that they make, that they use to make tartar sauce has a pickle in it. You know, like if it's relish or whatever. It but anyway, you see that, right? You see how that looks? And let me hold this up right. Ah, you see that? That's a big piece of fish. Now I'm gonna go in and take a bite and I'm gonna let you know what's better. If you're a fish and chicken lover, the chicken or this Big ass piece of fish they have right here. Hold tight! All right, so let's give it a bite. I don't know what side I want to start from. This thing is really hanging loose. <laughs> Hang tight. Uh, I guess I'll start from the side with the pickle on it. You see that? The pickle? I'm gonna bite that one right here to get the full flavor of the tartar sauce with the pickle and all that stuff. Here we go. Uh oh, uh oh. Look, slipping out the back of the bun. Get in there. Get in there, you pretty thing, you. Okay. Let me take a bite from the other side. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. You know, what I think I need to do is split. Mm. Right? Let you see what's popping on the inside. They got some good chunks of fish in there. It's not like they can't get other fast food restaurants in the butt. Popeyes really got something going on, and it's spicy too. Not like a Cajun, like a flavor. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. Yup. Look at the fish up in that too. Oh, I am so loving it. Especially what the Cajun flavor. Mmm. Mmm. Look at that. All right. All right. Okay, so, you want my honest opinion? If you like fish, this kicks ass. Oh, yeah. This kicks some real butt. Thing is, is that still got those chicken fans out there. Still got the chicken fans. 
But if you need to take a break from um, the chicken and you like fish, I ate the whole thing. Like, there's nothing left. You won't be disappointed. This is definitely the shiz nizzle. My dizzle. This was really good. Popeyes, I'm impressed. I didn't think anybody could do fish better than like a White Castle uh, fish sandwich. You know, you got Burger King, but I really don't like their fish sandwiches and stuff. McDonald's is okay, but then you know you go to the Chinese places or one of our, you know, fish spots to go to, like Popeyes over there in uh, Beth Page, Long Island. Shout out to Popeyes. That review is coming up real soon. You won't be disappointed. Yeah. Guess what, Popeyes? You made my day. And um, as a reminder, I want to tell everybody, got the t-shirts in, all of the good stuff, all of the great videos are coming up. And so you guys be prepared for it. It's going to be awesome. We're going to have a great time, especially during the springtime when it's time to barbecue and I'm doing my thing on the grill, flat iron grill, cooking at various, you know, uh, uh, different places. And I just want you guys to enjoy. Remember, all of my uh, um, top fans get a free t-shirt. If you want it, register as a top fan, share a video, like them, all of that good stuff. And go to Popeye's if you're a fish lover and um, get yourself a fish. Take a break from the uh, chicken sandwich that people got killed for. I couldn't believe that. People getting killed over a damn chicken sandwich. Are you kidding me? Man, it got some damn nerve. <laughs> Get out of here! 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 Get out of